Good morning. <clears throat> We're here. We're here. We made it. It was such a long drive yesterday. <laughs> I just got here and I showered and I instantly fell asleep. I was asleep so hard, you guys, yesterday. <laughs> Anyways, today uh, it's 8.10. I have to go to the front office because I had a late check-in. There's like a little box that you like pick up your stuff if you have a late check-in. And then it says you have to go back between 8.30 and 11 a.m. Uh, to check in with your ID the next day. So we're going to hit that up at 8.30 before we continue into Joshua Tree National Park. I know. Hey, Merry Early Christmas, by the way. I hope you and your family have a happy and healthy New Year in 2024. I have lots of fun videos planned for you guys. And we're ending 2023. Yes, I am in another state again. This should no longer be Jillian Camps, Arizona. It should be Jillian Camps, California, Nevada, Utah. <laughs> But we did go, we were in Arizona, in southwestern Arizona, uh, at Oregon Pipe Cactus National Monument yesterday, which was super nice for you guys. It was last week. So, come with me. We're going to have a nice day. It's beautiful out today. The sun is shining. We're going to have a great day, a nice hiking day. And first, I'm going to eat this cereal. It's good, actually. It's got lots of blueberries in it. Jesus. Hey, look. I found a sign. Joshua Tree National Park. Here we go, finally. We made it. <laughs> go figure, right? Okay, let's see what we're gonna do today, huh? Okay, so we are, we're actually up in here. So we're gonna be doing the Discovery Mine, the Queen Discovery Queen Mine up here. So you kind of hike up to it, come back down. And then I think we have to drive back this way, actually. I didn't realize that. So we may be doing the Barker Dam next, if that makes sense. All right, here we go. I got my snacks, I got my water, and I'm bringing poles. Forget it. It's a 600 foot climb up. We don't need no stinking poles. I mean. All right, this is a nice hike so far. People are like, it's rocky. <laughs> Love reading the reviews sometimes. Also, oh yeah, it's kind of windy today too. So yeah, we'll have to see how recording goes today. Oh, I think this is the house, actually. Look at this. This is cool. Whoa. Is this a window? Can't get in. I wonder what that is over there. It's like another room. Or uh, like a storeroom, maybe? It's hard to tell. Very cool. Wow, this is well preserved out here. I'm surprised with it being so close to the trailhead. It's cool. Somebody balance that rock up there. <laughs> I wonder if this was a storeroom or uh, I don't know, it's hard to tell. And like, the rocks look like it has a face on it too. It just says that the Desert Queen Mine in the Colorado Desert was one of the more long-lived gold mines in Southern California's high desert region. Look at these ruins, isn't that cool? This is a different kind of rock, huh? Look at this, oh, that must be it right there. Well, that was easy. Oh, wow. Wow, that's an easy trek. <laughs> okay. How cool is that? It's not three miles. It's more like not even one mile to get out here. What on earth? Do they bring horses down here? Jesus. some type of wash. I think we came from up there. So you just come down and then come around. It's kind of cool. Simple information that I wrote down. This mine is located within Riverside County, California, and is located within the boundaries of Joshua Tree National Park. It's also on the National Register of Historic Places. 
and just says, a hiking trail goes there. Wow, Jillian, no way. A hiking trail? Shut the front door. <laughs> All right, let's continue. This is interesting. It's massive, whatever it is. I mean, look at how big this is. This looks like a child's toy almost and large size. Should we go check it out a little tiny bit? Watch for bats, would you? But look how cool it is. I don't really want to go back in there, honestly. <laughs> There's nothing back there, that's it. And look at these old tracks too. That's cool. Okay. Like, do they just like rappel down the vertical mine shafts and then uh, like dig on the side and then <laughs> bucket it out? Especially in 1890s. It's not like they had technology or how they even find this out here. How on earth did they bring all the tools out here too? Ooh, that would be a lot of work. Like there's another one right there too. We have a lot of like vertical, horizontal shafts too, which is crazy. Yeah, don't go in, you know, because <laughs> it's like the mine is all around us. There's another one up there. Like it's all like walled off. I've never seen so much. Dang, they had to weld that. This looks like it used to be walled off. It was broken down. What do you in there? It goes up there instead. I think we'll go back this way. Look at all this though. This is like filled in. You can feel it. See? All these rocks. You can go across it. Dang. This is a heck of a lot. Look, that probably goes down in there too, mining. down there at the uh, the mine just taking a look at it it's really cool I mean they really preserved a ton of it it looks neat let's play find the trail you get a prize if you win that's where I came from <laughs> but which way do I go either way I think hard to figure out where do we go. Okay, there we go. Hey, look, found it. Yes. Wow, this is a nice hike. Woo. All right, I did 50 minutes in the first mile. <laughs> I gotta get going out there. Let's do it. We gotta hit up some of these miles, you know? Jeez. Up here. Like, look at these boulders are huge. This looks like this first camping in this area. Look, there's a fire ring over there. Isn't this nice? Lizard, my friends. <laughs> Look at these. Are these water water wells? Whatever they call it.
shit there is. Hi, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Pardon. Damn, you big guy. You scared the shit out of me, man. Are you hiding in that bush? I think you were. I about cramped myself. I thought he was a... <laughs> I thought he was a snake. I thought you were a snake, my man. You're not a snake, are you? Well, you sure are cute. You took Waller? I got those uh, cookies. Protein cookies. Let me show you the thing. Not a sponsor. It's these guys. I don't know if you've seen those two. Larry, Larry and Larry's. Protein cookie. Uh, you've heard of these. That's the new thing that all the kids are doing. Anyways, it's a cookie, but it's protein. It's pretty dry and bland, but it's got chocolate chips in it. You know, how could it be terrible? Mmm, very good. This tree is interesting, isn't it? Eat my cookie still. <sighs> Rock climbing. My fave. As we know. What the heck does the trail go? Rock scramble a bit up there. Go figure. Climb from down there. another mine. Wow. Oh my god. In order to preserve violated the subject, in order to protect the park's culture and natural resources, camping and campfires are not allowed. Please leave all objects and natural materials undisturbed. Leave nothing behind. Where is it? Holy shit. <laughs> I think it's down this way. Rock scramble. Holy cow. That was nuts. Dude, I don't see it at all out here. <laughs> Holy shit. I came all this way and I don't see it because I'm a dumbass. No, I can't find it. Okay, so the things say to the right of the sign. I went that way. There's nothing down there. I mean, over here? Let's try over here. Oh, jeez. Where? Where is it? Okay. Well, it's really freaking well hidden, that's for sure. It's called a cliff house. I don't see where. Where would you put a cliff house? I mean, I genuinely do not see it. Here goes my pepper spray and my whistle. Shoot. Oh, that's gone now. <laughs> oh well. Fell in between those rocks. There's nothing up here. Okay, I'm just gonna go back. I'm like on my butt. Oh Lord, I'm gonna jump down in there. I'm not gonna be able to get back out again. Also, I'm a giant scary cat. I just want to let you guys know. I'm sure bouldering. This is cool, though. Look at this. Shh. 
shoot. Well, fell into that crevasse. Oh well, it's gone now. This is cool though. How on earth did they build all this? This is nuts. I'm sorry, you guys, but this first hike, I cannot believe it, but I think we're going to have to claim it as a failure. Well, it's not really a failure. We got to the Desert Queen mine, but where the heck is the cliff dwelling? I don't see it. Did you guys? It says it's easy to miss. Yeah, you can easily miss it. I don't see it at all. Holy cow. Preserve America's past. Preserve America's past? Oh no shit. It's really difficult to get out there. I, you know what? I'm guessing that it has to be out there somewhere. Like in that clump of rocks or... The thing is like when you turn a corner all of a sudden it's like boom! You know? But I, I do not see it through here. We got a ton of other hiking to do too. I just don't see it. What the heck? Well, all these freaking side caves. You just don't know where to go. Oh. <laughs> Dude. What, really? Look at this. Oh, okay. Why is the sign all the way up there? That's weird. And then is this the, uh... Are you a cave dwelling? It's kind of cool. It's nice and cool in here. Preserve America's past. Look, I found it. Dude, this is this is a secret. I'm not even <laughs> There's so many people that come here and then do some rock climbing around on the cliffs. Whoa. This is cool. Look. What a beautiful view we probably had. Anyways, look at all this. I'm bolder. Look, I got scratches all over me like an idiot. No camping. I get it. Because you have all this cool stuff. here for everybody to see. Imagine this having like a locked door. Have yourself a little space out here. That's kind of cool. What they use that for? Maybe storage? For food? It's nice and cool in there. All right, look, let's go see where the sign is. That is a crazy deception that they do that. Yeah, it's like, please preserve no camping in this area. And then it, like the building's way back here though. It's way easy to, to miss. I feel like it's a rite of passage. That's what makes it so crazy. It's so well hidden. Just when I had given up all hope, that's all it takes. <laughs> Give up all hope and there it is. <laughs> oh man, that was crazy. Okay. Um, I think it's time to go back. <laughs> 
<laughs> Holy crap. This is nuts. I don't even know if this is the right trail. Let me check. What are you doing growing all the way out here? Okay. You sure do have a nice view, little poppy. You look like the last one of the year. So we did it, Desert Queen Mine done, and we saw the cliff dwellings. Those were kind of cool actually. Even though I was an idiot when I was rock climbing, it's cool, it's all good. I do not like rock climbing. I don't like bouldering, I'm not a boulderer. Okay, there we go. Face rock trail, oh, face rock. 0.38 miles, okay. A face shaped rock. Oh my God, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Why do people call this formation the face rock? This boulder is called face rock. To some people, it looks like a shape of face. Can you find the nose, mouth, and forehead? I feel like in order to appreciate that sign that I just read, I have to be five years of age or under. <laughs> people name rocks based off of the shapes they see. What a concept. Look, it's cool. There's that. And the nose and the eyes. The ghoulish, ghoulish mouth. I wonder if this truck gets a little closer to it, maybe. Yep, that's it. Time to turn around and go back. Let's see if we can see the face from this side. It's kind of cool. Wait a minute. You're telling me that people made rocks based off of the shapes that they see? What? <laughs> I can't, sorry. You're telling me that that looks like a face? I don't see it. It's kind of like a car, doesn't it? I named the rock car rock. <laughs> Look how easy it is, see? Car looks like a car. Got like a little head on top of a... I named the rock boy rock. It does look like the head of a boy, doesn't it? A child. Well, now it looks like girl rock, kind of. Elderly woman rock. I don't know. Cool though. I think I'm punch drunk. Oh, I've had a lot of sun today. All right, let's go back. I'd love to see a big orange sheep. Oh, well, this is interesting. Doesn't that look so weird how it's like put back together? Looks like somebody took like a big, big old piece of it, you know, and just and then gushed it out and then the cement kind of like was wet and it gushed out and then it dried like that. Doesn't it look like that? Face rock and new ones that we named. Grandma rock slash little boy rock and car rock. See? Naming rocks is easy. We'll go watch the sunset from a pretty viewpoint. Keys viewpoint, I believe is the name. We're gonna go watch that. For today, hey, thanks for coming with me. I really appreciate it. We did it whole day at Joshua Tree National Park. It was nice.